All right, well, if you're looking for something to do this weekend, there is some major talent coming to the Chicago area from country to R&B. Front Row Phyllis has a little bit of everything that's going to be around town. And we start with uh, the country boys, Dirks Bentley and we his love friends. Them, right? I love him. I know. This is a big country mega ticket. We're talking Dirks Bentley, Cole Swindell, John Party, all at Hollywood Casino Amphitheater. Excited about this. You know, this is actually his 11th headlining tour. He's called the leader of the Billboard's Hot Tours because he does so many of them, sells out about a half a million people, and he actually added more shows to this tour because he's having so much fun. Cole Swindell, we've heard all about. John Party, you're going to be hearing a lot more about him I in the next so couple too. of years. He's going to be headlining in no time. All yep. right, from there we go to an American in Paris at Oriental Theater. Yeah, so that just opened yesterday, and it only runs for a couple weeks, August 13th. It, of course, is that incredible Tony Award-winning musical that won in 2015 with the story of the American soldier and the French girl and that incredible European city. And it's just great. It's unforgettable songs to amazing choreography as well as heartfelt story. You definitely want to check it out. Okay, just a couple blocks from us here at the Chicago Theater, Lyle Lovett. I know, and I love Lyle Lovett. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to be here on Saturday. You know, he, of course, has, you know, had over 14 albums and you know what's so great is that it's only his second time bringing his large band to Chicago in 17 years. Wow, that's unbelievable. I know. 17 years. It's I been know. way too long for that. So you definitely want to check him out. All right, if you're looking for some family fun, something to take the kiddos to, Northerly Island is the place to be. It is. It's called Kids Bop. The kids all know about this. It's the best time ever over at Northerly. It will be a family-friendly live concert featuring, of course, brand new songs and great dancing and energy along with eye-popping sets, so it should be fun. Okay, July 30th, I've seen this name on the marquee, Mary J. Blige at Chicago Theater. This is big. You know, she actually just released her latest um, album, making it her 13th, uh, a couple months ago, of course, called A Strength of a Woman, and it debuted number one on the Billboard's R&B chart, which is no surprise. You know, she has sold over 50 million albums and 25 million singles. What yep. a talent. All right, August 3rd, head out to Allstate Arena for Shawn Mendes and Charlie Puce. This is a big team and tween again. And we're so excited. You know, he, of course, is that singer, songwriter, global sensation at 18 years old. Second album just came out and it's debuted at number one on the Billboard's 200. And, and also what's crazy is his single, Mercy, has been viewed over 115 million times. Expect more hits from him. Right. Too. All right, August 4th, Isley Brothers at Horseshoe Casino. We love these guys. Best known for their gospel and doo-wop music. And they're going to be going through their catalog of music, 60s, 70s, and 80s, over at the venue of Horseshoe Casino. And we wrap it up, Rod Stewart and Cindy Lauper. Isn't that what exciting? Is I love this. It's co-headlining, both of them, over at the Hollywood Casino Amphitheater and we're excited to have them here in Chicago. All right, if you need one more look at those, where can people go, Phyllis? Just go to frontrowphyllis.com. You know where to find it. All right, we're going to take a break. There's more Good Day Chicago on the other side.